This is Cougar Post Game Live. Coverage of BYU women's basketball is brought to you by Mountain America, the official credit union of BYU Athletics. By Wilner and O'Reilly, immigration solutions in Utah and abroad at wilneroreilly.com. Once again, here's Jason Shepard. Welcome back to the Marriott Center in Provo. BYU defeating Houston tonight 64-54 with the victory. BYU improves to 16-14. and This obviously ensures that BYU in the regular season will have a winning record regardless of what happens in Austin coming up on Saturday. So they're 16-14 and overall in Big 12 play. They are 6-11. and Let's get you some uh, final numbers. They're actually getting ready to honor the two seniors. And it looks like they're getting ready to do the haka for Kaylee Smiler. For, with her family is here to do the haka. They've come in from New Zealand. That's who it is. Obviously a, a rich tradition for Kaylee Smiler and her family being from New Zealand. What a cool moment for that entire family to be able to experience this together. So we'll talk with the coaches and players coming up after they honor both seniors. Let's get you some final numbers here. BYU shot 39% from the field, 41% from three. Houston, 31% from the field and 29% from three. BYU hit nine of 22 threes. And that really was the difference in this game tonight. And it started from the get-go. BYU was feeling it from the perimeter. It really started with Kaylee Woolston, who finished the game with 16 points. She was 5 of 8 from the field, 4 of 5 from 3, and 2 for 2 for the line. And if the 16 points weren't enough, she also had 5 rebounds and 3 assists. A great game for the freshman. Lauren Gustin led not just BYU, but all scorers. 19 points, 17 rebounds, her 84th career double-double. And in the process tonight uh, for her career, 1,650-plus rebounds. She's just been phenomenal. So she leads the way for BYU tonight, rounding out the scoring. Laura Davenport with 9. Amari Whiting with 10 points, 6 rebounds, and 4 assists. Smiler with 6. 2 points apiece for Rose Bubakar and Emma Calvert. As you hear the haka being done. Smiler's family was flown in for the occasion tonight to be able to share this with her. What a what a great moment for the Smiler family. Let's listen in for just a second. Smiler is on the other end of the court, obviously emotional as she hears this and watches this from her family. What a special moment. What a great thing here at the Marriott Center tonight. They've got her on the video board. She's in tears, but with her trademark smile. I mean, I know her last name is Smiler, but it's so true. She smiles all the time. And she was smiling through the tears. Happy tears, certainly, for Kaylee Smiler. Rounding out your scoring for Houston, 18 points for Layla Blair, 13 for Malia Johnson. And those are the only two Houston Cougars in double figures. Six points for McFarland, eight points for Aaron, five points for Boyd, and two points apiece for Patterson and Jones. We will take a break. When we come back, we'll... See if the uh, festivities are still going on, honoring the two seniors. Hopefully we'll be able to talk with a coach and a player before we wrap things up. We should be able to here on senior night. Fun night here in Provo. Cougars get the win, 64-54 on the new skin, BYU Sports Network. Here's more Cougar Post Game Live on the new skin, BYU Sports Network. 
Welcome back to the Marriott Center in Provo, Utah. Lauren Gustin being honored now. Kaylee Smiler went first. Now Lauren Gustin and her family, her teammates and coaches being honored here. Fun night for the BYU Cougars. They win by 10 over Houston, 64 to 54. And the crowd still hanging around, cheering on both of the seniors as they certainly deserve. All the family in line and everybody giving hugs and hope to have one of the uh, the coaches joining us momentarily. And then we'll have uh, one of the two seniors hopefully as well as we wrap things up. Uh, looks like we may be having somebody now. So we'll uh, get you a couple more stats. Don't forget coming up. On Saturday, BYU at Texas. We'll have the game for you here on the new skin, BYU Sports Network, 6 p.m. Mountain Time. With this win tonight, BYU now has officially moved into 10th place in the Big 12 standings. So, again, if you want to have the opportunity to avoid the first day games, you got to be a top 10 team. 11, 12, 13, and 14 play each other on the first day, on, on the 7th of March. If you can stay top 10, you at least have a bye to the second day. So right now, BYU would get that bye. Depending on what happens Saturday at Texas and with some other teams around them, you know, BYU obviously certainly wants to win and see what happens, but unfortunately it's, it's not really totally in their control. So we'll have to wait and see what happens uh, in the regular season finale coming up on Saturday. As for Houston, they will also wrap up the regular season. They will be at home hosting uh, Central Florida uh, at the Fertitta Center in Houston, Texas. All right, we should be getting somebody coming up here in just a quick second. I know my man Austin Rustin, uh, women's basketball media relations, is uh, trying to grab us somebody before we sign off here. It looks like the celebration has come to an end, so it should be momentarily we'll be able to get somebody. Speaking of the two seniors, if you're just tuning in, Lauren Gustin, 19 points, 17 rebounds in her final home game. Yet another double-double, her 84th career double-double. As for Kaylee Smiler, six points, one rebound, and one assist in the victory for the BYU Cougars. You know what? Let's see here. If we're going to get somebody, if we need to take a break, all right, we're going to go ahead and wrap things up, it looks like. The, uh, the players, it's uh, going to be uh, family time for a lot of these, and they don't want to pull them away. So we will go ahead and take a break uh, and wrap things up. That's going to be our broadcast for tonight. Thank you so much for listening. I hope you enjoyed it. It was a pleasure to be able to bring it to you. And, hey, you got to hear a win in the final home game as the Cougars win 64-54 to over the Houston Cougars. Our next broadcast, again, coming up Saturday in Austin as the Cougars face the Texas Longhorns in the regular season finale. Until then, my name is Jason Shepard. You've been listening to BYU Women's Basketball on the new skin, BYU Sports Network. Go Cougars! You have been listening to BYU Women's Basketball on the new skin, BYU Sports Network. Coverage has been brought to you by Mountain America, the official credit union of BYU Athletics, by Wilner and O'Reilly, immigration solutions in Utah and abroad at wilneroreilly.com. By Utah Children's Dental Network, Utah's network of premier pediatric dentists and orthodontists. Learn more at utahcdn.com. Brought to you by Zions Bank. For 150 years of helping you succeed, Zions Bank is for you. Also brought to you by Smith's Food and Drug, proud partner of BYU Athletics. BYU Women's Basketball is a production of BYU Athletics in association with BYU Broadcasting. Special thanks to BYU President Shane Reese, Vice President Keith Vorkink, Athletic Director Tom Homo, and Associate Athletic Director of Corporate Sponsorships Casey Stoffer. BYU Women's Basketball is an exclusive presentation of the new skin, BYU Sports Network.